Happy Wednesday, boys and girls. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance with Miss Parsons' fourth grade class. Good morning. I have a video read aloud I would like to share with you today. It is called Bad Dog, Good Dog. It is written and illustrated by two former Osceola teachers, Mrs. Conway and Mrs. Keck. In the video, Mrs. Keck is the one reading it with the puppet Skylar. You must check it out. You all know how much I love animals and this story has an amazing message for you. You can find it via Facebook, or the WONN News Twitter page. You gotta check it out, boys and girls. Have a great day and know that I miss you so much. Keep reading, bye. Good morning to my favorite people in the world. It's Ms. Florio, your school counselor, just wanting to say hi and wish you a wonderful day. I wanted to share with you a little SEL tip for the day, and that is that sleep and laughter are the two best cures for anything. So what I want you to do, and your challenge for the day today, is to do your best to make someone else laugh and to make yourself laugh. Maybe think of a really funny joke or put on a little comedy show at your house today. Do something to bring joy to yourself and to others. Also, Try to make sure that you get to bed a little bit earlier tonight. Maybe do something before that makes you feel calm and relaxed and then crawl into bed and have a nice rest. And then I bet tomorrow will be an even better day than today. So I'd love for you to share with me any jokes. If you wanna send them into me in an email or post them on Twitter to me or reach out and share them, that'd be great. I also wanted to share with you my own joke and it's the reason I'm wearing this hat and this scarf so I hope that you like it here goes ready what did the hat say to the scarf you hang around here I'll go on ahead <laughs> hope you enjoyed that have a great day make sure it's filled with laughter and smiles bye Good morning, awesome Osceola families. This is Miss Cleveland here with your PBIS tip of the day. The tip is finding the right tone. Using the wrong tone could have far-reaching effects with your at-risk students. Every student is different, so what works for one student may not work for another, but once you find that right tone, the rewards will be great. Thank you. Have a great day. Hi, awesome Osceola. Here's our math problem of the day. Tom had 114 baseball cards. He kept 10 and shared the rest evenly among his eight friends. How many baseball cards did each friend get? I'm gonna repeat the problem, boys and girls. Tom had 114 baseball cards. He kept 10 and shared the rest evenly among eight friends. How many baseball cards did each friend get? All right, boys and girls, I'm still getting responses on the math problem of the day, and those boys and girls are getting the answer correct and earning house points. I just wanna challenge all of you to participate and send me an email at blbrunr at volusia.k12.fl.us. Have a great day, boys and girls.